This is Nicholas from JoyfulArtist.org. Uh, this is a picture of, uh, I recently did last night on um, Stacy and her one of her best friends, Adrian, on a scooter. Uh, I just wanted to, I told you guys before how my character Stacy is more on the adventurous side. And she's more of a, a lover of a lot of fun. She likes to travel. She likes to, uh, as you can see, ride scooter with her friend Adrian. They're both kind of like wild child, and it's, I get this inspiration for these characters from like different instances in my childhood in, in high school. A lot of the kids had like dirt bikes and scooters, and they would like constantly be on the on the move. A lot of times would skip skip class. Not okay, just for the record, parents not endorsing that. But they would skip class and they would be on their dirt bikes and they would be on their scooters riding around town. I remember seeing that many times as a teenager growing up. You know, a lot of the kids were very free spirited. We had certain classmates that were just 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 fun loving. They made everybody laugh. They weren't the really studious type, just just focused on their studies, but they were very adventurous. This is kind of how my character Stacy and her friend Adrian are. They live for the moment, like a lot of people do when you're young. And I think, you know, to a certain extent, it's okay to enjoy yourself today because you don't know if you have tomorrow. But as you get older and wiser, you know, you learn to uh, look at everything in perspective. It could come with age. Some of us never grow up, though. That's 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 a fact. Some people never grow up, and it's always about fun and enjoying life. But the, this is a, this is a character who enjoys being a free spirit. And one thing I wish I would have did more of at 18, instead of just working, I wish I would have took a trip outside the country. You know, went to China, or uh, you know, or Philippines, or some somewhere really different from America. I wish I would have experienced that. So I will say this to anybody that's a teenager or that's young out there, you should try something different, you know. Get that scooter with your with your taxes if you want it, you know. You're 18, 17 years old, don't have a whole lot of bills and responsibilities and children or anything like that. Enjoy yourself, you know, because you'll never be 17, 18 again, uh, 17 or 18 again. But don't be reckless about it. You know, you have to be responsible. I'm not I'm not endorsing anybody doing anything illegal, like stealing steal a dirt bike or anything like that, you know. But, you know, if while you're young you should try to enjoy your life because you don't know if you'll have tomorrow. You know, you definitely should save some money, but you know, don't be afraid to do something adventurous and out of the box like Stacy and Adrian here. Uh, they are from New York City, but they take a trip to L.A. together, and it's talked about in one of my stories. Uh, they take a trip to L.A. together, and they, they live on the edge. They're very, you know, fun-loving individuals. You know, Stacy has known Adrian for a long time. They used to party together, so they're now taking adventures outside of their home city. And you know, I just believe that when you're young, you should you should you should try to do something adventurous. You know, take get you a passport, guys. I I finally got my passport um, early last year. I was supposed to go to Africa this year, but you know, I didn't plan correctly for it, so I'm gonna have to plan for that another time. But I'm 24 now, and I I personally wish that at 18 I would have took a trip outside the country and been more adventurous. You guys, don't spend all your time working and studying. You know, life is very short. You know, if there's a country that you want to see, you should go see it. If it's a if it's a business that you want to start, you should start it while you can. You know, because you don't know how many years you're going to have. Sadly, a lot of those people in Las Vegas lost their life. You know, and that's why I'm saying while you're alive, you know, pursue your dreams and pursue something that you really enjoy, you know, that's not going to harm anybody else or anything like that, but but that you, that, that, that'll be very exciting for you, you know, some of you guys love travel, you know, you should, you should embark on that, if that's something that you enjoy, 
That's something that I plan on doing. My one of my bucket lists. I want to go to Thailand. That's like at the top of my list. I really want to go to Thailand, and I and even Japan one day because of uh, my favorite filmmaker, Hayao Miyazaki. He's an animator. Um, Kurt, he made a lot of amazing animated films, and I would love to visit Japan as well. So you guys, don't be afraid to dream. Uh, this is this is uh, characters from my book that's going to be coming out the end of November. Uh, Stacy and, and this is her friend Adrian with the green hat. And you guys stay tuned. Follow my blog, joyfulartist.org slash blog if you want to learn more about these characters. And I will stay in touch with you guys. And everyone have a great day.